What is going on YouTube? Today we're going to be doing a full day of eating and as you can see I'm going to be starting the day off with a little iced coffee. If you're wondering how I make the iced coffee, it's pretty simple. Just a couple of quick ingredients like a half a cup of almond milk or you know 120-25 uh, milliliters of almond milk as well as about five grams of zero calorie brown sugar. I also include about three grams of a regular sweetener and I use the Walden Farms Caramel Coffee Creamer. You can use whatever you want, but this is the one that I like. And then a shot of Nespresso and some ice, and you're pretty much ready to go. The good thing about this is it's super low calorie. We're looking at like 30 calories total because it's only a half a cup of almond milk and then the Nespresso itself. So not very heavy in calories, but a good way to start the day. And of course, I'm gonna go ahead and add my supplements into the first meal, as well as this coffee, but I'll probably be adding the first meal into breakfast as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and finish up this coffee, and then I will see you all at meal number one. So for meal number one today, we're gonna to do some waffles as well as some eggs. This is one whole egg as well as two servings of the carton uh, cage-free eggs. So definitely excited to eat this. Fair amount of volume here. I've got some sugar-free syrup on these bad boys and they're chocolate chip waffles. I don't know why, but I've had a hankering for waffles lately. So I'm gonna enjoy these. Now as for this breakfast meal goes, so far we're looking at 638 calories, 60 grams of protein, 76 grams of carbs, and 13 grams of fat. And that's gonna include my morning supplements as well as that little latte thing that I made in the beginning of the morning and all of this food. So pretty excited about that. This is gonna be about a quarter of the food that I'm gonna be eating today. So definitely starting out strong. So I'm gonna finish this up and I'll see you all in a little check-in in about an hour or two. So here's a little physique update that we've gotten the last couple of days. I've really been seeing the belly fat come off. Of course, you can't target belly fat. It just is clear that <clears throat> some of the veins and things like that are really starting to pop. And I'm starting to look a lot leaner. I'll also put my weight on here because I feel like that's something I've been terrible about lately. Uh, I haven't really been showing anybody my weight, so you'll probably be seeing me eat around one gram of protein per pound of body weight. I'm um, sitting at 166, that's after the first meal today, so, uh, you know, give or take maybe a half a pound, but overall, looking pretty good, feeling pretty good, and definitely enjoying the progress and, you know, seeing all the results come in. Also, keep in mind, like, I'm not competing or anything, this is just a simple summer shred, getting cutted, cutted, getting cut, and trying to, you know, improve my physique, so that way, this summer, you know, I'll feel fine taking off my shirt at the pool. I'm getting ready to go to the gym, so I'm going to go ahead and bring one of these Gorilla Mode Whole Food Bars with me. Uh, one thing I do want to make a point to mention, and I think I've said this before, but you should always try to eat whole foods over protein bars and protein shakes. However, I will be on the move, so I'm going to take one of these with me, so that way after cardio I can go and get into some uh, shenanigans, you know. I'm thinking about going to the skate park. It's a beautiful day outside. I haven't been skateboarding in a super long time. Uh, so I think that might be the plan. Let's get to it. All right, cardio is done, and I'm gonna go ahead and eat my protein bar like I said before. I'm super excited for this because that was hard as balls. Fuck yeah, that's super good. All right, it's time for meal number three. As you can see, I made some steak wraps here. This is really just a simple cold recipe. So I have some extra steak on these. This is about three and a half ounces, as well as about an ounce of baby spinach. I've got some hummus on here, and then these wraps are the low carb tortillas. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat this. You can see it's pretty low calorie. We're looking at like 360 calories, give or take. Um, so definitely a good little meal to kind of cap off all of the activity that I've had going on between the gym, going to the skate park, and all of that. Also, I should mention that I didn't end up filming at the skate park. The reason for that was because there was other people there, and I always feel weird, like, setting up a camera because some people aren't comfortable being in front of a camera, so I don't really want to, you know, intrude or get in the way. So, I didn't end up filming that, but I think we're going to go on a little adventure later on today that I will be filming, 
so stay tuned for that. Um, this isn't meal number four or anything, but I do want to mention that. I'm drinking a cherry vanilla Coke right here, zero sugar, so just want to add that in. I do drink a ton of water, but I want to be as transparent as possible. I do drink zero sugar sodas from time to time, so just wanted to throw that in there. We haven't quite gotten to meal number four yet. Before we do get there, we're actually going to switch it up a little bit and leave my apartment today. So I'm going to take you all with me to this golf place where basically we get to hit golf balls into a big lake and it's basically a driving range. Um, so yeah, enjoy the footage that you're about to see. All right, we just finished up playing golf. Hopefully we got a couple of clips. Uh, and uh, I don't know if you were watching videos last year or not, but if you were, then you know that I've been trying to get better at golf. Been taking some lessons here the past couple of weeks. So hopefully, if you have been watching, you're noticing some improvement in my swing. So definitely a cool thing, good feeling. And uh, I am hot and hungry. So I'm going to go home and prepare me. Prepare prepare meal number four. All right, for dinner, I'm keeping it real simple. We're just gonna do some edamame, ground chicken, and some white rice. You can see the macros on the screen here, calories and everything. I know this isn't the most exciting meal, so as compensation, I'll go ahead and mix it up for meal number five. I got a little dessert in mine, so definitely stay tuned for that. All right, meal number five. Last meal of the day, we've got some protein sludge. This is the recipe from Nick Bear. If you've seen my old video, I did a video where I made protein sludge. That was Nick Bear's recipe. So, as you can see, macros here, pretty good, very high protein. It's only about 400 calories, a little less. Um, and I add some brown sugar and stuff like that, so I am going to eat this and finish it up and just enjoy it. That puts our totals at the day at 2,138 calories and 204 grams of protein along with 233 grams, excuse me, along with 223 grams of carbohydrates and 64 fat. I'll take it. So that's going to be it for today's video. But before I go, I do want to say thank you to everyone that's been subscribing. It really means a lot to me that everyone's been following the channel and showing support. I've seen my numbers go up, so it definitely means a lot. And of course, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video.